My passion as a dentist has always been to save people from unnecessary dental treatments. Now you may say, what's so bad about a filling? Let's break that down. You see, the thing that disturbs me the most, I think, is that most people having a filling done have no idea that this cavity was caused by a bacterial infection in their mouth. Let's call that dental disease. And putting a filling in the hole in your tooth does absolutely nothing to stop that disease. So the disease continues in your mouth. Those bacteria will communicate with other bacteria in your throat and in your nose and everywhere else in your mouth. And the filling doesn't address this. So often other teeth will begin to decay in the same way or even around the filling you'll have over a period of about five to six years, the damage will start to occur around the edge of the filling. And dentists will call this sort of something as if it's surprising, a recurrent decay or secondary decay. It's the original disease that never was eliminated. The second problem I have with fillings is the materials that we use. Today, I'm sure most people know that silver fillings contain mercury and that mercury in your mouth at mouth temperature is really not a healthy thing. I'm not suggesting you take out all your silver fillings, by the way, we can have another video on that. But one of the reasons I don't want you to do that is that there isn't a really good alternative. You see, white fillings are full of toxic chemicals. The original ones were just loaded with bisphenol A, which is a very strong hormone disruptor. And even today, I am not comfortable with the white filling materials and sealants that are often placed in people's mouths. So instead of chasing disease and leaving it in your mouth, why not get rid of that disease before you even have a filling done? So the best way to get rid of dental disease in my opinion, after 50 years of helping people, is with the regular use of xylitol. Nothing else is able to eliminate these cavity-forming bacteria so effectively. Combine that with the over-the-counter products I recommend as part of my complete mouth care system. You can find all about that on my website, drellie.com, and you will be able to get rid of this disease in your mouth and maybe even avoid having a filling.